Hello, and welcome to Undertale, part the next one. I ran into a cutscene that just started. And now there's a fucking hamster looking at me. Oh. Oh. My god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. Um, cool. I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and... Who are you? You seem to be slowing down. I'm not... Um... Uh, hiya! I'm Dr. You're Dr. Alphys. Asgore's royal scientist. I'm gonna kidnap you and get all your bullshit out of you. Crazy. But, but uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights, your friendships, everything! I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on the screen really makes you root for them. So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. And, well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Anyway, recently I decided to make it more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, a laser cannon, machine gun, rocket launcher, railgun, anti... anti-human combat features? So, with anti-personal rounds. Of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made it see mistake while doing so, and, uh, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood? <laughs> but, um, hopefully we won't run into him. Uh, oh. Oh. Did you hear something? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, damn. Here he comes. He's here. Oh no. Oh yeah! Welcome, beauties. Uh oh. Ah! Oh no! It's one of these. Today, to today's quiz show! Ah, oh, fuck me. Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show! Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant! Oh god, I hate him. Never played before, Gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly, or you die. Metaton attacks. Oh god. I can't really... Check. Metaton. A 10 attack and 199 defense. His metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Uh... Uh... More questions. Right! Sounds like you get it! Oh god. Can I cry? I'm gonna cry. Screaming is against the rules. Here's your terrific prize! What's the king's full name? Dr. Asgore Dreamer. Correct! What a terrific answer! The quiz show continues. He's so fucking scary. Enough about you, let's talk about me! What are robots made of? Metal and magic, sugar and spice, metal and magic. Too easy for you, huh? The quiz show continues. I'm gonna use Mercy because it's quicker. Here's another easy one for you. Two trains train and train be simultaneous to first station and stand be. Oh god. Wrong, wrong, wrong! That was fucking. I didn't know how long. Oh no, I didn't have very long, did I? One more of those and I'm dead, so let's go ahead and <laughs> cram a crab apple down our throats. We get the crab apple in your HP next time. Don't count on your victory! How many flies are in this jar? You, girl, help me. You need to fucking help me with this shit. 
completely, utterly wrong! So if I... Oh, God. So these are basically become impossible. Let's play a memory game. What monster is this? It's a pocket. Oh! Boy, that's embarrassing, huh? You're fucking kidding me. I'm gonna fucking die to this thing. But can you get this one? Would you smooch a ghost? Heck yes. Great answer! I love it! The quiz show continues. Oh boy. Here's a simple one. How many letters are in the name Metaton? You know what? Break out the big guns. <laughs> oh, I know this one. It's snail ice cream. In the fourth chapter, everyone goes to the beach and she buys ice cream for all of her friends. But it's snail flavor. She's the only one who wants it. It's one of my favorite parts of the game because it's actually a very powerful message about friendship. And... Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Ooh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer, too. Who does all Dr. Elphys have a crush on? <laughs> Seriously? My, my. How conceited can you get? I love it! And while you're completely wrong, you deserve some credit. I've seen her watch you on her computer screen, smiling when you succeed, shrieking when you fail, and always, always whispering, no, wrong, you have to go that way. In its own way, is this not love? Well, well, well. With Dr. Elvis helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama. More romance. More bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. Oh, that thing took all my health. You owe me so much health. Well, that was certainly something. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. Wait, wait! <laughs> Let me give you my phone number. Then, maybe, if you need help, I can... Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second. Please. <laughs> But this phone is special to me. It was given to me by Toriel. No. Here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting. Items? It's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom! <laughs> oh, Doc, that I miss you fucking. Alright, let's take a look at that new phone. It's, uh, dimensional box A. <gasps> so my piece goes in there. I'm totally fine. <laughs> I have so many items. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, I want to talk to Toriel. Uh, Toriel! It's beat up figurine of a female human with cat ears. Seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. It seems like a walkthrough to a game, or... What happens if I go up this way? Nothing. So, I didn't... That was horrible. I would've fucking fa... Like, that made it basically impossible. It's a bathroom sign. Yellow feet are tapping just behind the door. <laughs> oh, I can't go in here. The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. So what you're saying is... That the fucking thing <laughs> only could have gone so far. Great. Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All these books are labeled Human History. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Oh my god. VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They're all labeled Human History. What the fuck is that thing? Is that the Tubby Custard Machine? That thing's horrifying. <laughs> All these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. All these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book.
it's a comic book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in its mouth. Ah, oh, seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. The tubby custard machine is here. Pink goo drips in the strange machine. Pink goo drips in the strange machine. Looks like Dr. Alvis' work table. Seems dusty. Looks like a pretty sure Dusty. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed falls into an extremely easy to draw box. It's a promo poster from Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, Thank you for making my dreams come true. This is weird. Oh. I can't seem to run it. So I think that's that's her fucking room. It's weird. I went around and looked upstairs. It was boring. Are you still in the pisser? Nope, she's gone. She's gone. She doesn't know where I am. Ha ha. That was fucking... Alpha's updated status. Just realized I didn't watch Undine fight the human. Is she just gone now? Did she just fucking disappear? Where the fuck did she go? I don't need this. She, she didn't even give me her phone number. I can't even call Dr. Alphys. This is a weird time. This is a weird time in my life. Don't think I like it. Not sure I like it. Just get the fuck out of here. Damn it, Dr. Alphys. You fucking fat girl otaku. Oh god. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll, I'll ask her about it later. Oh god. Oh my god. For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. Ah, oh boy. Here it comes. Well. So they wanted to go, really, so. Nope. Oh. Vulcan strolls in. Hello. Check. Vulcan, attack 8, minus 10 defense. Mistakenly believes it's lava can heal people. You're hurt. I'll help. No, no, no. No, no, you're not doing the helping thing. <laughs> Smells like a lava lamp. Encourage? Hug? Both of those would kill me. Encourage. You tell Vulcan it's doing a great job. It attack it att its attacks will become extreme. Ah, it does my best. Oh god. Oh fucking Christ on a fucking crutch. Parades around you proudly. Can I leave? Oh my god I can, but what if I hug it? You give Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart, and your whole body. Ouch! Your defense dropped. Ah, so lovey. Ah, oh god, this is a big mistake. Mm. The bright heat. You give Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart. Okay, I was seeing if there's anything else I could do. Hug continues. Oh god, oh god, oh god, that's the pain. That's painful. That is not good. Cheeks glow with the bright heat. Oh god, oh god. I'm trying to figure something out. I'm helping. Oh, oh Jesus. This isn't even like you. This is just like a different thing entirely. This is horrifying. Courage. You're doing a great job. <laughs> oh my god. Let me just stay up here. Can I just... Nope, 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 nope. Uh, go over to the hug. You're both gonna hug you for Nothing else happened. Okay. Lovey times, yay! So, I guess also else I can do is criticize it. You tell Vulcan that his attacks are not helpful. Uh, not helping? Okay. Get over there. That looks like a sack of trash. Trash. Oh. Oh, those streams of lava come from Vulcan's eyes. You tell Vulcan that his attacks are not helpful. Warms your heart. Nothing else happened. Okay. Okay, I didn't say to keep going, but whatever. So you can't just spare him whenever he's okay. Okay, this makes sense. Perfect sense. Alpha's up there to status. Gonna call them in a minute. Thanks. Fucking ridiculous. You're 
ridiculous, you know that? Oh, thank God. The whooshing sound of steam and cogs. It fills you with determination. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, this is a scary fucking place. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, Lal Mao. I need your fucking help, though. Okay, I can step on these. Oh. Sunderplane. It gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything. Ah, oh, not the Sunder plane. Check. I mean, it seems mean, but does it secretly like you? No way. Why would I like you? Oh my god. Oh my god. Chemtrails. 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 No, 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 no. Looks over, then turns up its nose. Approach. You get close to Sunder plane. Not too close. I, I, human? Uh, oh. Oh, oh! Get destroyed. Cinderplane checks its nose dismissively at you. <laughs> I approach. Not too close. Yes. So this 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 makes her really blushy. Boy, Charlie, flirt. You tell Cinderplane it has an impressive wingspan. Ah, is that true? No. Oh, oh, oh god, bombs! Those are bombs. Oh god, exploding bombs! Exploding bombs that explode! I was looking away, Charlie. Oh, I spare you. You what? Iron 6 to go. Oh, oh boy. This is, this is fucking hot. Heat, heat time. Officer just says, OMG, I've had my claw over the last digit for five minutes. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Why are you so fucking weird? Why are you so fucking strange? was calling, hung up before you answered it. Ugh! Dr. Elfin! Why? Okay, this looks like another puzzle, so I'm gonna go ahead and check out what's over here real quick. Oh, it was completely point- oh, nope, there's a thing. Oh, shit. There's a thing, though, so I want it. There's a fry pan lying on the ground. Will you take it? Take it. You got the burnt pan. What's it do? Weapon attack 10. Damage is rather consistent. Consumed consumable items yield 4 more HP. Shit! Well, actually, I don't really need that since I only have 20, so... Doesn't matter. Oh, no! I was mistaken. I didn't need it. Alright. That was weird. This entire place is fucking weird. Oh boy. So I can sell this. Uh, hi. So, the blue lasers. Uh, I, I mean, Alpha's here. Hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. The orange ones, um, you have to be moving and they, um, they won't, uh, move through those ones. Uh, bye. Oh my god, I did it! Claws haven't shook like that since Sunday and called me to ask about the weather. Oh. Oh god. Wait, there's no weather down here. Why did she call me? Oh shit. Well, this is not good. Okay, thank god we're out. It's a switch. Press it. The lasers were deactivated. Sweet Jesus, thank God. All of a sudden, it's status. Oh my God, I forgot to tell them where to go. Get pick of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. Uh, Alpha's here. The, the northern door will stay locked uh, until you solve the solve the puzzles on the right and left. I. I think you, 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 you should go to, to go to the right first. There we go. It's fine. We're going to the right. Ooh, I'm chill with these guys. The way to work is blocked, so I had the time to catch Metaton's show on my phone. 
The special effects were amazing today. That humus almost looked real. He's the most popular star on the underground. His fan club probably had at least two, no, three dozen members. <laughs> Alpha submitted status. Wonder if it would be unfun if I explained the puzzle. Alright. Shoot the opposing ship. Go over the boxes to complete your mission. Alright. Oh, cool. I did it! Congratulations! Wow, you solved it? I'm impressed? You must be a total nerd? <laughs> it wasn't that hard. Like, that was actually. Can I do it again? Can I get a harder one? Okay. That was easy as shit. That wasn't a very good puzzle, if I'm honest. Oh, no shit! Yeah. What to? No, 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 no! Why do you have to have such a massive range? Boom. Okay. Onward and outward. Ring. Alpha's here. That blue laser seems totally impassable. But, but as the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll, I'll hack into the Hotline Laser Database and take it out. Thank you. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now that we're free, we can... Standing here. We were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules. They've got to cancel school over this. Oh, oh. Shit. Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. Okay. So. Bam! I'm the winner! Congratulations! I am the winner of everything that is there is to win. Bam! Here I go into the wild beyond. Next time when we play Undertale again. Thank you very much for watching this episode. And I hope that you catch the next one so we can see what is behind this mysterious door. This episode of Undertale. <sighs> I love you all very much.